I've got the Samsung Galaxy Tab S5e and today I'm going to show you how to unlock the bootloader for this device. Now once you have activated Android we can then go into the settings application we need to enable developer mode and we do the, the by, by, we do that by going into the about tablet or about phone section looking for the software information section basically we're looking for the build number option right there we need to tap that about seven to ten times till it tells us that developer mode has been turned on and we can tap the back arrow a couple of times to take us back to the main menu screen for the settings application and this time whenever we scroll all the way down to the bottom you should see the now unhidden developer options page when we go in here you're gonna see a option labeled OEM unlocking it's just a simple toggle that we tap and once we tap we're gonna get that prompt that pops up and we just tap the turn on button after we have enabled that OEM unlocking toggle we then need to power off the device because we need to boot into what is known as download mode we're going to use the USB method for booting into download mode which means we have a USB cable that is connected to our PC the PC is powered on we are then power off the tablet we're going to press the volume up and volume down buttons at the same time and while we do that and while we continue holding those two buttons we insert the USB cable as we continue holding those two volume down buttons after we have inserted the cable it's gonna take a couple of seconds as you saw and then it's gonna boot up to this bright blue screen once you have accessed the this specific download mode screen using the USB method we can then take that USB cable out and you can see here we have three options from this splash screen we can press the volume up button to continue which just bypasses the splash screen we can press the volume down button to restart the phone but again we're going to unlock the bootloader so we're going to long press on the volume up button after a couple of seconds you're going to boot over to this unlock bootloader screen right here you're going to get some warning text at the top be sure to read it make sure you know what you're doing you're going to be losing some features like Samsung's secure folder and Samsung pay and all that stuff by unlocking the, the bootloader so be aware of what you're doing before you proceed however at the bottom of that screen you're gonna see two options again we from here we can cancel out by just pressing on the volume down button that will not unlock the bootloader and it will just restart the tablet instead we're going to be pressing the volume up button to unlock the device and then after you confirm that you want to unlock the bootloader you're gonna see the tablet reboot it's going to perform a factory data reset and it's going to reboot again it's all normal and this next reboot this one that it's on right now it's going to take longer than normal because it needs to activate Android it needs to set up all those files so that you can sign into your account and set stuff back up
So again, that boot is going to take a few minutes to complete. Simply be patient. It's going to stay at that logo for a while. And it's eventually going to continue with its boot cycle and take you to the Android activation screen. And there we go, we are booted back into Android. The device has been reset. You can restore your data from a backup from like Samsung Smart Switch. We can even go back into the settings application if you want to check and make sure. We just need to enable developer mode again. This time when you scroll through the developer options page, you're not going to see that OEM unlock toggle at all, which is kind of surprising as my experience with these devices. Once you unlock the bootloader on a Samsung device, the OEM unlock toggle will still be there, but it will be grayed out. This may be exclusive to the tablet. It may be a new change that Samsung's going with just something that I'm experiencing with this particular tablet right now. So there you have it. That is how to unlock the bootloader of the Samsung Galaxy Tab S5e tablet.